in part 2, we'll check out still more basic kick combos without even adding any new techniques. This time, we'll start out with hook setups, pop 180 hook, and swing 360 hook, aka tsunami kick. You can connect these two kick tricks to each other in either order, pop hook to tsunami, or tsunami into pop 180 hook, or you can double them up. Two tsunamis in a row counts as a vanish transition, while in order to connect two pop 180 hooks in a row, you'll need to return stance to front side in between. Next, we'll look at adding round kick tricks to our hook setups, such as the pop 180 round and cheap 360 round, more commonly known as tornado kick. You'll then have pop hook to pop round, a pop transition, as well as pop hook tornado, and tsunami pop round, as well as tsunami to tornado kick, which is a redirect transition. There is another basic round technique, the swing 360 round, which if you add into the mix, you can create two new combos with pop hook to swing round and tsunami to swing round. Both of these require a return stance to front side after the hook landing of your setup. For part two, we'll include a third hook setup, the cheat 360 hook. This technique exponentially increases your connection options, first by repeating those shown at the beginning of the video with just the hook kick tricks, using the cheat hook as a new setup to enter into the other basic hooks, and second by using the pop hook and tsunami as setups to enter into the cheat 360 hook. You can also repeat the round connections from this new setup. Cheat hook redirect to tornado, or cheat hook to swing round for example, which counts as a return stance vanish, also called wrap transition. Finally, certain connections can be spiced up by using complex transitions. Try connecting any basic hook setup to a pop round using the misleg transition, or to a tornado using the carry through transition. For that, you'll need to be able to do a redirect without setting the kicking leg down in between tricks. Adding a cheat hook to any hook landing without touching the ground creates a swing through transition. These concepts and a few basic kick tricks are all you need to keep things challenging and fun. 